Hi, Movie Recap Zone here. Today we will explain a 2015 action comedy titled Vampire Academy. Get ready for some spoilers, take a seat and enjoy. Rose is a girl who has a telepathic bond with her friend Lissa. Since escaping a special school a year ago, they are still adapting to life in the outside world. They enter the kitchen, where Lissa bites her and feeds on her blood. They notice someone watching them, and they start the pursuit. They manage to capture them and one of the guys, Dimitri, tells them they must go back to the school. He then takes down Rose and takes them back to the school. The school is a special place for the Maroi kind, the vampires who are mortal, just like Lissa. Rose on the other hand, is a Dompier, which is a half Maroi whose task is to protect Maroi. On their way to the academy they encounter some sort of a danger, and Dimitri goes to investigate, while girls remain in the vehicle. Rose is able to free herself from her handcuffs and exit the vehicle. As soon as she walks outdoors, a Strogoi approaches her. More guards arrive and manage to subdue the beast. The Strogoi are evil vampires who are immortal just like real vampires. Finally, they arrive to the academy, which attracts Maroi and Dom Piers from all around the globe to study. The Maroi study magic and the Dom Piers learn how to battle. Their secret organization has its own government, with 12 royal families rotating as leaders. Lissa is from one of such families, and she has the potential to become a leader in the future. Dimitri summons them to speak with the headmistress Kirova. Dashkov comes in and begs the headmistress not to punish the girls harshly for escaping. Lissa is the last of her family's line and a potential heir to the throne. When the headmistress threatens Rose with expulsion for assisting the possible successor in fleeing, Dimitri enters and informs her that they have the connection between them, which is extremely rare. They all manage to persuade Kirova to let Rose stay in the end. Later, the Dom Piers have an exercise class, and Rose joins Mason and the others. Mason later knocks her unconscious in a simulated fight. Rose's connection with Lissa is suddenly reactivated. She notices her on her way to the school church, chatting with Christian about his parents who turned into Strogoi. Lissa and Rose eventually meet again, and she informs her that she spotted her with Christian. They enter the school cafeteria, where there is a human feeder program so Lissa starts to feed. The girls then go to church where Lissa inquires about Mia, who is a girlfriend of her ex-boyfriend Aaron. Suddenly, there is a tremendous boom outside the church, and everyone runs outside to find that Lissa's family monument has been desecrated. Kirova drags Lissa away and orders everyone to retreat to their rooms. Rose makes plans to see Jesse the following day. They meet and start making out and he wants to eat her, but she refuses to let him. While they make out, Jesse tries to take a bite into Rose, but she refuses him to do so, and Dimitri rushes in in the right time to stop him since Jesse refused to stop. Rose suddenly gets another vision, this time seeing Lissa outside her chamber, where a dead fox has been hung up. Dimitri and she dash over to her. She informs Rose that she tried but failed to bring it back. Later, Rose and Natalie search Lissa's room for her, but all they discover is a bloody message on her wall. Natalie is the daughter of Dashkov. Rose instructs the girl to taste the blood and inform her as to whose blood it is. She informs her that the blood is Maroi. Lisa resolves not to flee the school again and suggests that they investigate Mia. Rose, on the other hand, believes they should concentrate on Carp. Rose then meets Christian, who is worried about Lisa. Rose informs him that Lisa dislikes him. Rose and Dimitri rehearse the next day in the woods. He informs her that her only weapons against the Strogoi are sunshine and silver. They go back to the school, and he inquires about her mother's letter, given that she is one of the world's most dreaded Dom peers. Dimitri inquires as to what she knows about her Maroi father, but she has no idea. Rose has another vision afterwards. Lissa is conversing with one of Mia's friends and uses compulsion power to persuade her and her friends to uncover information about Mia. Rose approaches Lissa and informs her that utilizing her talent comes at a price for both of them. Natalie and Rose are later going through Mia's computer. They come upon pictures of Mia and Lissa's brother all of a sudden. They were dating, and the girls suspect he had harmed her, leading her to hate the Lissa's lineage as a whole. As time passes, Lissa continues to impose her compulsion on everyone at school, and Rose fears that it is transforming her into someone she is not. If the dark forces take her over, she might turn into Strogoi. Later during her practice session with Dimitri, Rose inquires about Carp. He claims he has never heard of her, which enrages Rose since she believes that everyone avoids talking about her. Rose sneaks into Kirova's workplace the following day and discovers a CD. 
she realizes it's a collection of videos featuring carp. She claims in one of them, that those like her who never declare a magic are always drawn to darkness. The following day girls are attending the party where everyone is having a good time. Later, as Rose was walking away Lissa follows her and they start to argue over Christian. They then hear a commotion, and Natalie appears, informing them that something has been following her. They hear a howl, and Rose claims she was being pursued by a side dog. The girls flee, but the monster pursues them. Lissa discovers her bag in the middle of the playground, with her cat dead inside. She starts to resurrect it, but she passes out before she can complete it. After seeing her fresh wounds, Rose again remembers how she is the only one who can save her. Rose later tells the school staff about her mission, saying that it was the reason she needed to get Lissa out of the school. One of the instructors inquires about Lissa's ability to resurrect the dead, but Rose responds that she can only bring people back from the verge of death. Kirova is skeptical of Lissa's compulsion abilities, but Rose assures her that she has used them on her. Kirova offers to show her the remainder of the carp footage. Dimitri informs Rose that Carp had a nervous breakdown and transformed into a strogoi. Rose has another vision of Lissa approaching the professors and using compulsion to persuade them that what Rose had told them was a lie. Christian and Rose later meet at the library. Christian believes the headmistress, the queen, and Mia are conspiring to drive her insane. Lissa sees them and assumes they're dating, but he assures her they were only trying to assist her and kisses her. She pushes him away and declares her hatred for him. Rose and Lissa then have an argument and Rose tells her about Carp. That irritates Lissa even more, but the two calm down eventually and act as if nothing happened. Later they go shopping in the mall. Rose tells Lissa that Kirova will soon separate them so they need to quickly figure out what is going on. After the mall, Natalie gives Rose a beautiful necklace for the upcoming party. Later at the party, Christian can be seen dancing with Lissa. Mason tracks down Rose and forces Jesse and Ray to reveal the truth about Mia to her. They claim to be the ones who scribbled the gory message on Lissa's chamber wall, but they deny that they killed her cat. Mia interrupts Christian and Lissa's dance and starts to lash out. Rose doesn't believe Mia when she claims she didn't harm the cat and mocks her in front of everyone before knocking her unconscious. Rose is imprisoned in a chamber when she sees Lissa being abducted. Kirova enters and prepares to sedate her, but Rose outsmarts her and administers the sedative to her instead. She rushes to Dimitri's chamber to inform him about Lissa. When Dimitri learns the necklace is a love charm, they proceed to make love. After that get in their vehicle and search the academy grounds for Lissa. They also discover Christian hiding in the back seat. Rose then has a vision. She sees Dashkov has taken Lissa a prisoner, because he is about to die and needs a powerful healer such as Lissa to keep him alive. He wants her to sacrifice her life for his, claiming he would be an excellent leader of Maroi. She is tortured by a blind vampire. He is forcing her to use her powers which she eventually does. In her vision Rose locates Lissa and they all rush to help her. Dimitri goes first, and Rose and Christian follow. Dimitri then engages in a fight with Dashkov soldiers. The final battle has just begun. Dashkov sends his Psy Hounds after Lissa, while Dimitri is fighting Dashkov Guardian. Outside, Dashkov sends a chopper after his opponents but Rose and Christian manage to knock out the pilot. Dashkov then shoots Christian but gets shot by Dimitri as well. Psy Hounds then attack and Christian stops them, but needs help after his attack. In order to heal him, Lissa first needs some strength, so she drinks blood from Rose. Christian is then healed. Back at the academy, Kirova tells Rose and Dimitri that Dashkov has been sentenced to jail and Natalie has been expelled. Rose is informed that Dashkov wants to speak with her. He explains that Lissa's power was reawakened in the accident, and that she utilized it for the first time to rescue herself. She had passed over to the other side and returned when she was kissed by shadows. She turns around to discover Natalie has transformed into a strogoi to assist her father. She frees her father and continues to battle Rose in the jail. Simultaneously, Dimitri comes and apprehends Dashkov as he attempts to flee. After a quarrel between him and Natalie, Rose finally kills her. Lissa learns more about her new powers and then declares she will never turn into a strogoi, she will never let dark forces take over her, because she had Rose on her side guarding her. Lissa confronts the queen as she arrives at the school. She informs everyone of her proclaimed powers and gives a speech to unite the kids. Carp is discovered to be planning an assault on the school with an army of strogoi at the very end. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. See you later.